guys good evening you are welcome to my youtube channel the explicit tutorials as you all know i'm Dr. joseph or mr explicit and you have here uh, part two of exam like questions of phylum nematoda your eb111 exam is just eight days from now so it is very important you commit the answers to memory try to memorize the questions as well as the answers very very important in the part one of this video we treated question one to ten so in today's video we shall be taking 11 to 22 or 23 as the case may be let's get started which of these is true about the nematodes separate sexes or diversions fertilization is internal males are smaller than females they bear a pair of copulatory speakers all of the above the answer is all of the above number 12 the free living forms of nematodes are usually carnivorous in nature they are carnivorous in nature so the answer is b number 13 phylum nematoda is divided into two classes phasmida and aphasmida that is what option d phasmida and aphasmida number 14 the pair of glands or sensory structure found at the posterior end of certain nematodes is called fasmid fasmid so the answer is c fasmid number 15 the well-developed sensory pocket light structures found by the fasmids is called amphids amphids d is the answer this topic has been treated already on my youtube channel so i will not have time analyzing all the options if you haven't watched the videos it's better you watch it okay for a better understanding so the next one is the presence of pocket like amphids five or more osophageal glands are characteristic features of class a fasmida a fasmida option d all right they have a pocket like amphids and of course the esophageal gland is about five or more number 17 which of these classes excuse me which of these classes contain mostly free living forms but some are parasitic the answer is class a fasmida class a fasmida number 18 which of these which of the following does not belong to class a fasmida the answer is ascaris lumicoides the the T's are under a fasmida. All right, the tri, that is the trachina, the trachuris, and the trachella. They are all under class a fasmida. But as for the ascaris lumicoid, it belongs to class fasmida. Number nineteen, presence of fasmids and three esophageal glands, both living and parasitic forms, are features of class fasmida option c number 20 all belong to class fasmida except b trichuris trichuris belongs to class uh a fasmida so the answer is b trichuris does not belong to class fasmida number 21 pinworm is also called enterobius vermicularis Pinworm is also called Enterobius vermicularis. So the answer is C. Number 22. Filera worm is also called Wuchirinra bancrofti, Oncosecia vovulus, Enterobius vermicularis, Jococula medinensis, Chachuris, Chachura. So the answer to this question is not actually spe specified here. Which Vuchira bancrofti and Oncosecia vovulus are both filaria worms. So at this point, excuse me, at this point, we we'll call it a day, and I'm about to drop the part three of this very video. Please subscribe and endeavor to subscribe, like, share, and comment.